What's up guys, I'm Major Conflict, and today we're playing The Melting Apartments, a moody and surreal horror adventure game inspired by the Junji Ito stories. It's about a young woman who disappears after moving into an old building at the edge of town, and it's up to us to find out what happened to her, and possibly have to escape with our life. Another missing persons case. So many lately. The parents called it in. The daughter had just moved in for a couple weeks ago, and they haven't heard from her since. Hmm. I better remember to get my gun this time. I think I left it in the glove box. Hey, we all love some guns, now don't we? There we go. Hey old piece of resistance. Let me get that. I hate using this thing. I don't. Give it to me. You put the gun in your inventory. Bam. So, so with this trash, we can't do nothing with that? What else can we do in here? An exhausted face looks back at you. I'm tired. This job is killing me. Maybe I should just quit. Oh, snap. We got an option. Stay or quit. Judging by this guy's face, I think uh, we're going to go ahead and quit. Uh, okay. What are we doing, my boy? Hey, look at him go. Screw it. I don't need the stress. You quit your job. The mystery remains unsolved. Hey, every mystery don't need to be solved. The end. Hey, look at that. We earned the ending. One of three. All right. We got our job cut out for us. Uh, the door. Oh, shit. Look at us go. And we, uh, can't go off screen. Another condemned building. Not the last in this city. I mean, I know we can go for the alleyway, but I want to see what else we can do. Can't go off screen. Oh. Yeah, this bit is pretty shitty. And it's vacant. Inquire within. Who's this jerk? A man sits there. He won't respond. He's a loser anyways. Proceed. The hell? <laughs> Hello. You must be the detective. I'm the building manager. I run the apartment for the landlady. Wonderful woman. Please follow me. Helen's apartment is upstairs was that guy a shadow or I thought I'm confused manager's office is locked it's probably the best I'd be in there tearing something up the basement is locked interesting every step you take feels wrong it does. I'm following a guy in a freaking Halloween mask. Your feet sink into the stairs. What kind of place is this? There's the old weirdo over there. What's this on the wall? Might be important. Notice from the manager. 
Please, keep quiet after 9 p.m. Okay. I'll do what I want. Ew. That off girl. Ungrateful. Always banging on the walls. Screaming and shouting. Good riddance, frankly. The brat. I'm glad she's gone. So what do you know, ma'am? Are you sitting here looking crazy? Now leave me alone. Foul woman. It's rude for no reason. My mom is in here. She's gone. Mom always said not to talk to strangers. You're a stranger. Hmm. I don't like it here. I want mom to come back. So we got kids living by themselves. Old, mean women. I mean, what else we gonna run into next? This place is a mess. Add for a local band, Ribbon and the Hemlocks. I've heard these guys are awful. Please, you have to get me out. I feel like I can't stand it anymore. I don't know why I said that. I love it here. You should go. She needs... I need to rest. Yeah. You, you look like you do. You need a glass of water. Uh, you need... Go to bed, my man. It's fucking weirdo again. Here is poor Helen's apartment. You're welcome to speak to her. Neighbors. Don't. But don't push them. We're upset after her disappearance. Such a waste. Oh, I've already talked to the neighbors, so... Who has their kid moving to a dump like this? Let's, let's look around. The stench of rot overwhelms you. Old food. Yummy. Yo, that soundtrack is bumping, I ain't gonna lie. The old table. Nothing to see. This is a couch. The couch is covered in mold. I don't think anybody's been here in a while. The window is jammed shut. It won't open. So far, the clues are pointing to no one's been in this place. The TV static plays endlessly. What is this? Hmm. Looks like a typical cable. That's why I don't have it. Family photos. The girl in them looks sad. Hmm. What's this look like back here? Looks like nothing. As expected. Holy shit. Is this the shiny? Who put the axe in your inventory? I mean, at some point, are we gonna need these items or, or what? Everything's covered in mold. I don't think anybody's been here. This must be Helen's diary. Uh, let's read it. January 17th, 1973. Moving in took forever. Nobody offered to help me move in. 
some friends I've got. Thanks, guys. January 18, 1973. Seriously, I just move in and now the walls are leaking? This place sucks. I could have told you that. The 19th of January. My front door is jammed. I can't open it. I try calling the manager, but the phone doesn't work anymore. This place sucks. The 20th. I'm freaking out. I woke up and this gross shit was dripping into my mouth. I don't feel good. I need to get out. I don't know what to do. 22nd. Fuck this. I'm getting out of here. One way or another. 30th. I'm so scared. Somebody help me. I can barely move. I feel so weak. It's hard to write. I think I'm gonna die in here. And... I hear someone talking to me. But what the hell? A strange black liquid begins pouring from the ceiling. The liquid burns through your skin. You need to find a way out. Fast. Yeah, I'd say so. Oh, shit. Oh, we got that axe. Let's see if we can use this axe. You equip the axe. So, uh, how do we axe this door? You broke down the door with the axe. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, chief, let's go. You broke down the door with the axe. Where can I ask their doors? No response. No response. Yeah, I know this old bastard ain't finna open it. No response. Alright, I'm out. You can leave, but you have a feeling there is more to uncover. Uh, alright, let's stay. I feel like we're gonna die because we chose to stay. But oh well. Nothing to see there. It's a trail? The bed is covered in blood. Helen? Possibly? What's this note say? Is that not a note? A new tenancy agreement for Helen's old apartment. Replacing her already, huh? Yep, yeah, it's definitely getting spooky. A picture of a happy man. Is this a photo of the manager? He definitely didn't look like that before. We find a journal in the desk drawer. Hell yeah, we're reading it. Open it up. I hear her. she's speaking to me. She wants more food. I have to feed her. She needs more. She's beautiful. She needs to eat. You reach the end of the journal. There's a hidden key. You put the key in your inventory. Sweet. I wanna see if we can get this last drawer though. Nope. Nothing we can do with that. Yo, what the hell? Is that a heart? A black canned cancerous heart is locked in a glass case. There's a key latch on the side. Uh, I can see that. So I guess we gotta equip the key. Yeah, what the hell is really going on in this place? You equip the key. put the heart in your inventory. Yeah, I definitely want a black bloody heart in my inventory. All right. Um, I just feel like something spooky is going to happen. So let's go ahead and 
at least keep the you know what let's keep the gun on us something definitely going on need to be strapped I have no reason we have plenty of reason did he not see what just happened well, let's keep the axe then oh so buddy really acting brand new right now okay if we die it's your fault hold up I don't think this blood trail was here before. Oh shit. Yo, what? Yo, what? What's going on, son? Yo! Oh, you found us. Yeah, I did. What you out here doing? Don't look at me like that. Would you like to meet her? The landlady? Yo, what's good? Uh, oh, you think? I should use my gun. Oh shit, Sherlock. Yeah. Equip. Yo. <laughs> Holy smoke, buddy. Alright, that's what I'm talking about. He's dead. Good. God damn right. What about this landlady, though? A fire rages in the gaping maw. What the hell is this thing? Can I kill it? Or do I just walk away now? I think this used to be Helen. Poor kid. I turned around a freaking hamburger? So... Oh, you know what? We got that heart. We got that heart. Let's see what we can do with this. See, bam! You equip the heart. You want this? You throw the heart in the fire. Oh! All right, I'm assuming that's our escape scenario. All right, bam! All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. The building goes up in flames. kind of hard to make out what the hell I'm looking at. You drop away, uncertain if you did any good. You tell yourself those people were already lost. The end. Burn. Okay, that was uh, ending two of three. Let's see if we can try to get back in here and find out that last ending. We're just gonna do everything opposite this time. We're not gonna talk to nobody. We're just going straight in. We're going to Renegade. There's other rooms that I was curious about. Yo, what? The bathtub is overflowing with a black tar-like substance. There's the toilet. Even if I needed to go, there's no way I'd use this. I mean, I think that's why we have a, a wang, a schlong, if you will. Yo, a hole has been dug into the wall. It looks like the wall is bleeding. Mmm. The building's alive. I think we already know that now, though. Okay. Alright, let's we'll see what happens. Na 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 na
if you're gonna take me, I'd rather you go do it now. I'm waiting. Oh, damn it. The acid burned through your skin. Nothing is left except bone. You have died. Ah, okay. Melted. Oh, that didn't give us an ending. Interesting. Alright, so we came back in again. Um, this time this guy over in the corner. He's uh, not looking too well. God, what happened to him? Uh, overdose. I'm calling it. Please, take my baby. Please get her out of here. I'm sorry. You should go. I'm fine now. Okay. Um, so we got some uh, change in dialogue. A friendly bunch. Hmm. So he doesn't say what he normally would have said. And if you remember the first time we came up here, he was blocking the way. Now he's just standing off to the side. Hmm. Okay. Something ain't right here. I think I'm starting to catch on to what's going on. Mm-hmm. He's already dead still. So apparently it's had to, we have to break the cycle. We don't do nothing that, we just leave. There's nothing else to uncover. We leave without solving the case. Is it better this way? It's gonna have to be. Leave. Okay, guys, that's uh, three out of three endings right there. Um, but I think the moral of the story is that the melting apartment is uh, actually a live being and it lives off of the tenants. It kills them, they're reborn just to die again. Hence is why they can't take it anymore. They're ready to get out of there. But for some reason, they can't actually leave. The manager is the only one that seems somewhat captivated by the creature. But after we killed him the first time, he was dead in every other reiterance so that we came back. So that part's a little funky because if everybody else died, then why didn't Helen come back to life? Uh, maybe there's more lore to this. It was a pretty cool game, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, I'll leave the link to the itch.io page where you can play this yourself if you like. Um, other than that, if y'all have any suggestions of what you'd like to see me play next, so put it in the comments section. Uh, other than that, man, I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace.